Welcome to a productive 7.45 a.m. morning routine. It is currently 8.11 and I'm gonna head off to the gym right now. And today I basically plan to hit glutes and abs. This is basically the outfit for today. So I have on my set from Adenola. I have this white tank top from Tank Air. back from the gym. Honestly, today at the gym, it was a pretty good session. I did glutes and abs today and honestly, I feel so energized. So we're gonna be making my protein yogurt bowl. This is something I've been kind of obsessed with. This is basically some chia seed protein pudding that I've made last night. So I just combined half a cup of milk, one tablespoon of protein powder, and one tablespoon of chia seeds. I'm supposed to do two tablespoons of chia seeds, but the last time I did that, it was too hard. Tablespoons. Gonna be adding some banana. I'm gonna try and make this as pretty as possible, even though most of the time not really too fussed. Okay, let's see if I can do this. Gonna be adding some peanut butter. Guys, I really tried to make this look pretty. I'm so sorry. Taste test. I didn't bother adding honey because I feel like the protein powder is already sweet and the banana also makes it sweet. Hi! Hi! Say hi. <laughs> I got the stupid nighttime tea. It said a little gift of sleep inside. Yeah, better pretty me. If I don't have the best sleep of my life tonight, no, I'm gonna cry. It's I'm gonna so cry. funny. Mm. More like sad. Five. <laughs> I will fight someone in this house. <laughs> I honestly feel so well rested despite waking up at 7.45 I've actually been able to achieve deep sleep and I've been sleeping so well recently That's why I'm here to quickly introduce the sponsor of today's video, BET Slumber So BET Slumber is a tech brand all about creating comfortable, noise reducing products I've actually been using their sleep earplugs for the past week So because Freshers Week was basically last week, a lot of people have been going out for refresher events There's a bar and club not too far from my flat And honestly at night I can kind of hear the music and people shouting or talking Literally my point. I found myself being able to sleep a lot faster than I usually would. They come in this mini little case and it's so cute. It's literally so small and I love it because it's easy for like on-the-go travel. So with each kit, you basically get four different sizes. You get S, M, L, and extra large. It's really nice because you can kind of play around and see which one fits your ear before it makes them super comfortable. And this blue little thing is basically what creates the noise cancelling effect. So it's not noise cancelling, it's just noise reducing. So you can honestly use this when you're in the library studying or when you're in an event or maybe when you're at a concert or festival and you don't like the super loud like in your ears base you can honestly use this as well so I love how versatile and multi-purpose this product is 
you just put them in your ear like that. If you guys are interested and you guys want to know more about BET Slumber, they're actually launching their new product, which is a noise cancelling earplug. If you guys want to know more about that, click the link in the description down below. And let's get on with the rest of the video. So I basically just did an everything shower and I just threw on a really comfy set. This set is from White Fox Boutique. It's just a pink lounge set. So I'm going to do a little bit of hair care before I make my coffee. I'm going to first go in with the Ordinary Multi-Peptide Serum. I basically just put this all over my hairline and my roots. I literally just got this in the mail today. It's basically the Japanese honey hair oil. Oh my god. It actually makes my hair smell so good. My hair literally feels so soft right now and it smells so good. I feel like when I first put it on, it was a bit strong, but once you put it in your hair, like the smell kind of just diffuses a little bit and honestly does not smell super overpowering. Are you guys seeing the shine right now? I'm literally obsessed with this oil. And my hair feels so smooth, like... It's around this time I usually make my coffee. I used to always just drink coffee first thing in the morning on an empty stomach and kind of trying to like break out that habit because I heard it's not good for like your gut in the long run. It can really damage your lining. There's nothing really to line your stomach. Coffee is really acidic. So I made coffee this morning whilst I was eating my little yogurt bowl and... I'm so sorry, but coffee really only tastes good with oat milk. No shade to people who do drink oat milk. Honestly, I think all my friends drink oat milk, but I just can't do it. I don't know, I just gonna, I just prefer the taste of like whole milk. I think growing up, that's all I drank. Mm. That's a lie. I was actually allergic to whole milk when I was like four. Guys, literally stop what you're doing. It's sunny out. I literally haven't seen the sun in maybe 10 days. Okay, so right now we're gonna be doing some skincare. I'm gonna first go in with my Anwa Toning Water. I'm then gonna go in with my Beauty Joseon Glow Serum. I've been using this almost every single day and I love it so much. Look at that glow. And then my favorite moisturizer at the moment is the Beauty of Joseon Dynasty Cream. I honestly just love the consistency of this because it's so lightweight, but I feel like it keeps my skin so moisturized. So I love putting this on in the morning because I don't like, because especially before my makeup, I don't like my skin feeling like it has too much product on it. And you guys obviously know I always use my La Roche Posay sunscreen. Even though I literally never see the sun in the UK, I never skip on an SPF. So glowy, I'm obsessed. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen me do my makeup so many times. I'm not gonna go too much in detail. I'm actually getting ready to film some content. I basically have to take some Instagram photos today for White Fox Boutique because I'm basically part of their student ambassador program now. So I have a few deliverables this month. Feel free to use my code, Elena UWF. Honestly, the under blushing technique is so useful. Love it. And also using a powder puff instead of like a brush has really helped my under eye creasing. I actually have really bad under eye creasing, but ever since I started using this, it's helped quite a bit. I press the powder in. I kind of like to do this. I like to rub the powder into the back of my hand to kind of even out the distribution. I feel like this has led to like the most even under eye. I feel like I always have crusty under eyes. The only thing that's really helped me so far. I got two blushes in the mail. These are from Yesel as well. They're basically the Romand blushes. Vine Nude, which is a very like pale, light pink color. This one's blueberry chip and it's quite cool toned as well. I heard swiping it is the easiest way instead of packing it in. It's kind of blending my current blush with my under eye concealer. I love this formula so much. I don't know if you guys can see it, but... Yeah, I just love this blush combo so much right now. I'm 
Okay, so I'm going to attempt to do some doyin hairstyles. Basically the vibe. I'm just wearing this pink set from White Fox Boutique and it's so comfy and cute. I love it so much. Then they're so petite friendly. I had to kind of alter these to make them shorter, but I love the low waist. I'm wearing the top in double extra small and the pants are double extra small. The top is a little bit see-through, so I suggest sizing up if you want it to be less see-through. Even though I'm super petite, I could honestly go for extra small just because the double extra small is just so form-fitting, but it's a vibe anyway, the tighter the better. Okay, so I just finished shooting some content for White Fox, but that's basically my morning. It's literally 12.46, so the morning is over. Thank you so much for watching this video, and this was my realistic 7.45 a.m. morning routine. I usually do most of these things, except obviously do my hair, because I never really do my hair. But yeah, by the way, this ear cuff is so cute. I literally got it from Taobao, but I think you can get it at AliExpress. I'll try and link it down below, because it's honestly like so cute. I love ears. My ear is giving coquette. Sorry. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!